Stairway to Heaven Arena never gets old. I love being here in Purgatory. And if you love Full Metal Mayhem, you might just want to spend the rest of your life here in Purgatory. I'd rather take the elevator to hell than spend another minute here. I bet my left nut on their last home game and literally lost half the family jewels in the transaction. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The Orcs of Hazard battle. The Full Metal Mayhem. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. If you're just waking up wondering who put that vice on your head and filled your mouth with vacuum cleaner, dirt, and cat litter, you're not alone. After all, it's Sunday, MFL game day. Hey, you look tired, Junior. And Bricks, you look like they just used your head in field goal practice. Spent all night in the ER. We ate Chinese food last night. Food poisoning? I wish. I got the chopsticks lodged in my ears again. You know, they should have a warning on them things. And it's first and ten. <laughs> A crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore, Grim. Oh. And that'll be second and eight to go. And he just slipped away. And the ground game is starting to soften up the defense. Bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays! Talk about luck! And it's first and ten. Oh, the defender almost picked off the ball on that one! Second down and ten. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. I know I said never hit a man when he's down. It's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. Third down and ten. They get their hands up and block the pass. And they'll line up for the punt here. Nice punt. Should move them back. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. You can't keep a good mute. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. Uh -oh. <laughs> Sticks his fingers in the defender's eyes, netting him a pickup of a boom, dead and down. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? Just some good old downhill run with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. And it's first and ten. It's about a three-yard pickup. Second down and seven. And like bricks and bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. Since when is that a penalty? Uh, since now, I guess, Grim. Uh, 
second down and a lot. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. And there goes the ref. Too bad it was supposed to be his last game before he retired, Bricks. Well, he's retired permanently now. Yeah, at least he'll save some money on the retirement party. Good point. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. I'm gonna say maybe three yards, but a tough three yards. Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. No, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. Oh, what a hit. Hey, Bricks, what does it feel like to get hit like that? Uh, like being dropped off a 10-story building with a refrigerator strapped to your back and landing on a fire hydrant. Yeah, great analogy. Oh, no, no, that really happened. Cod game got a little out of hand last night. You can't have five aces. Tired of the quarterback, tight spirals and Mac. Oh. If he was still talking, he'd be saying, Psycho killer, Keska say. Yeah. What the fuck, 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 fuck. And it's first and ten. Just follow the bloody footprints to the new line. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. And he made a mistake there, thrown into tight coverage. The result is an interception. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. That's a four-yard gain. Second down and six. And so at the end of the first quarter, we've got a scoreless game. Second down and six. It's two yard run before he stopped. Oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so do the fans. Third and four. That's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. And it's first and ten. And he's off to the races. First and ten. They run it for a yard. Second down and nine. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Bricks. This is going to get ugly fast. He's clung to the moon. Another loser.
bites the dust. And the NFL winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. He is just in good old downhill running there as he picks up the first down. And it's first and ten. I ate a piece of licorice once and got a shot like that. It wasn't licorice, you idiot. It was the frank cords of the leaf blower. Well, it was a red cord and it looked like licorice. The point is, uh, I forgot my point. The full metal mayhem rocked today and destroyed their opposition. They win by forfeit. There's not much left of the opposition and the fans are loving it. There was only one way this game was going to end, and that was in a forfeit. That's not quite true, Grim. The alien spacecraft could have crashed into the stadium and ended the game. Oh, how about it? How about if you shut the hell up right now? We go down to the field and listen to what the MVP has to say. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microheart Corporation. They get it right every 